pretty popular over in um, New Zealand. We buy a lot of horses that we watch go on the grass and, uh, and they come over here and do a good job. And uh, yeah, it, it, it's all going to be trial and see how we go. As you can understand, I do a lot of travelling, Dubbo and uh, down to Sydney and but probably at least once, twice a week. Um, and this gives me another escape not to have to travel so far. Yeah, a, lot, a lot of us um, won our first race or different things like that at Orange and uh, it was a little tight track but uh, always good carnivals and good crowds and everything like that. So the, yeah, so I think it'll be good just to bring, because like I said, you've got the amenities and everything and people come and see something different. Well, it won't hurt anyhow, it's better than nothing and that's what we we're going to have in this area and uh, with Bathurst going so strong and Orange Neal have had something completely different, uh, I think it'll be good for the sport. We at Harness Racing New South Wales didn't want to see um, Harness Racing move away from Orange. Um, we, we suffered from the fact that we had to transfer a couple of meetings to um, Bathurst last year, but uh, we're back, we're here. Uh, we're very thankful for the council who stro show strong support for the community and also for Racing New South Wales for allow us to, allowing us to use Tawak Park. The club here, uh, Frank McRae and, and Kel Winnell, have done a tremendous amount of work in, in making sure that this, these meetings are successful. We're in the stage of crawling at the moment because these will be our first meetings, but um, we certainly will be walking in the future and eventually running. And It, it can only benefit um, both uh, codes of racing if we have a, a dual code meeting with um, a thoroughbred race and then a harness race and, and, and we go forward. It gives variety and it certainly will be appealing to the community. It's about uh, using resources and the resources are the fact that, that there are many race tracks, um, harness and thoroughbred tracks across uh, New South Wales. Um, they're possibly underutilised in many cases so if we can combine these two equine sports or the two racing codes together it'll be a benefit for all. I had the joy of uh, driving on this track about in October I think it was and uh, it found it really smooth and really good. The horses got around it nicely. Speed-wise, um, it's going to be a lot different. Um, we, we had to get used to an angle. Um, it's 1400 around, whereas this is 18, 1900 a metre, I think. Um, so it took them a while to get used to that. Um, but then the grass might ease the speed out of them a little bit too. So, uh, yeah, something to look forward to.